Mac Maintenance with Onyx. How to keep your computer running smoothly. O-N-Y-X, if you search for it. It's a free um, program from Titanium Software. If you click on here, you'll be able to download it. So it's free. You just need to know what operating system you're running. So you'll have to download it. So to check your operating system, go up here about this Mac and overview. And mine says OS Sierra. Okay, so Sierra, I'm going to go down to High Sierra and click down. You'll need to put in your password because it needs administrative privileges. Okay, so Onyx opens up like this and it doesn't show anything in start. So you can just click on maintenance. Um, there are lots of other things, but maintenance one is mostly what you're going to need to use. So let's just start at maintenance because this is really all you need to use. So you can just check off the things that you want it to, to do for maintenance. Um, what it will do though is close the application when you click run tasks. So it will close everything and restart the computer usually. Um, it's good to just restart your computer every now and then, by the way. So verify structure, run maintenance scripts, launch services. Uh, I don't get it to do a spotlight index again. Spotlight index is when you could press command space and do a spotlight search. If your spotlight isn't working well, you can select that. I don't use mail, so I don't have this collect selected. Disk positions on desktop, system applications. Now you might want to just check the options in the internet stuff. So Usually this is fine. If you want it to delete your browser history, bookmark icons and stuff, you can get it to do that. For example, it can clear the cookie data or it can clear the form values, but generally I just don't get it to do that. Uh, that looks good. Log messages, font cache. Sometimes you can get automatically saved versions of documents and recent items of trash. Okay, so then I'm just going to click run tasks. It's going to say restart is requested and then it will do that. Maybe allow it for the first time. It might take between 10 and 30 minutes, depending on how fast your computer is, it just kind of cleans up some of the rubbish that gets caught up in the computer. So good idea just to do it, I would say every, I don't know, six months, couple of months, up to you how fast your computer is running. I'm not gonna click this now, but that's all you have to do.